Ndewo. Hi Oprah, this is Uche from Nigeria. I'm a young media entrepreneur based in the commercial capital of Nigeria, Lagos. Beauty is big in Nigeria, but let me tell you one thing. I'm in my office today and in Nigeria, beauty goes right along with brains. You have to be smart, driven, and educated. So it's very important. So I bet you're wondering what I'm wearing today. I'm wearing a dress made with Ankara. Ankara is the fabric of the people. It's the fabric of Nigeria and also other West African countries. Years ago, Ankara was considered boring, old, no young cool person will be caught wearing it but today is such a different story the young people have embraced it and taken it on and make made it their own so it's very exciting in nigeria beauty is all about celebration we love to express our beauty through our clothes specifically during special events like weddings anniversaries and birthdays one of the ways we do that is through asho ebi asho ebi literally means clothing of the people so for instance i went to the market over the weekend and i picked up these pieces of fabric so what happens is let's say a bride is getting married she chooses a specific fabric and all her friends and family come on that special day all dressed up in the same fabric but in different styles last year one of my favorite outfits was the ashwabi i wore for a close friend's wedding which i made into a dress very similar to Michelle Obama's inauguration dress. It was gorgeous. Whenever you see a Nigerian woman, she's always looking beautiful and well presented. Makeup and hair are a big deal in Nigeria. When it comes to makeup, um, Nigerian women don't go for the edgy look that you might see in New York or London. Instead, they go for a more soft, pretty look that accentuates their naturally beautiful features. When it comes to hair, I have to tell you, Hair is a big deal in Nigeria. When you see a Nigerian woman and you ask her, oh, what sort of hair extensions do you have? Many times they're like, oh, this is Brazilian hair, this is Indian hair, this is Indonesian hair. What I like to call it is the United Nations of hair. And this trend has been influenced by, you know, international stars like, you know, Beyonce, Rihanna. So it's not about trying to, you know, not be Nigerian or not be African, but it's more about, you know, being influenced by what global trends and superstars are doing. A big beauty trend in Nigeria right now is healthy and natural. So what that is, is that for some years there was a big, 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 big popular shift from processed food to more natural stuff. So what people have done is that they're using natural fruits and vegetables and fish straight from the source of the local market to create their foods. Another thing that they're doing is um, there are some pretty interesting homemade uh, beauty remedies that have been passed along for centuries and decades in Nigeria. So we're talking about going to the market, getting some herbs, getting some spices, getting some vegetables, getting some fruits to create some homemade um, skin remedies. Thank you very much. So I just bought some fish straight from the fish market. Like I said before, um, a big beauty trend in Nigeria now is eating the freshest food possible to ensure that you stay healthy and look fabulous. It's so important. So yeah, that's me with my fish. Let's go. Growing up, I was really skinny and I really hated it because at that time the most attractive Nigerian woman was, you know, the more voluptuous lady. But guess what? Over the years, things have really changed. Now, Nigerian women are, want to be a bit slimmer, fitter. Though we're not looking at, you know, the very thick, thin, anorexic model, no. We're looking more at like a healthier, fitter sort of body. So a lot of women exercise like I'm doing now.